before we get into this video please subscribe to my channel click the bell notification button and please like this video as well hey everybody welcome back to my youtube channel as you guys have seen by the title today i will be showing you her neon pink eye look because you guys have been asking me to film another makeup tutorial i do actually have um oh my god i'm speaking so fast in this intro i'm really sorry I i'm like I i'm I i'm like speaking so fast but anyway guys um yes i do actually have a makeup page on instagram it is makeup by alice holmes please go and follow me i'll pop it on the screen somewhere now um so please go and follow me before we get into this video look at these flowers like seriously these flowers are stunning like they are pink they are white they are my favorite color um they smell unreal like oh my god they smell fills my room like a flower scent like it's so nice um so uh, thank you to the person who brought me these like you probably will be watching this video um they are beautiful and these are the best flowers i have ever received honestly they are beautiful so that's why i like these like in the background because they're so pretty and oh my god they are unreal anyway guys um today i will be showing you how to create this eye look because a lot of people have been asking me to recreate it from my makeup page so I thought that I'll kind of make it into a tutorial because I don't really film a lot of tutorials also my hair's got cotton flowers without further ado let's go on with the video all the lovely eye products that I will be using on my eyes today Be Perfect Carnival palette which is huge um the colours in this are beautiful can you see the colours in there Gorgeous. My old five points um, pink shade in here because honestly the pink shade is um, really pigmented and honestly the colour is beautiful. Um, Sample Beauty Immensity Palette. I will be using probably like the blue and the purple shade in here. Those two there. They're really pretty. Peaches and Cream Eye Pigment out of this world. It's a um, neon pink colour and it's beautiful. Pigment Primer. Also like a pearl pigment for like the inner corner. Um, of the eyes so for my eye base i will be using the revolution concealer in c2 these concealers are perfect for like eye bases concealing under eyes spots i will be using my peaches and cream eye brush in pc 40 and um, perfect for carving out eyebrows and eye base so what i'll do like is basically put this concealer on my eyelids to basically um, make a perfect base this concealer has kind of dried out a little bit but I will try to put this on um, my eye base, like my eyelid, because we need to get a nice base for it. It's so awkward to hold this like this. <laughs> mm. Right. There we go. Now that my eye base is all sorted, I will be using this Mayo eye colour in pink because the colour is gorgeous. Um, real techniques like eye brush which is like, like a fluffy one and like I just could kind of put this like on my crease um everywhere like that so like this honestly guys the colour is so pigmented and honestly the colour is so vibrant um like the colour is crazy like the pink and everything in it so like all over my lid and crease to kind of build up the colour a bit so now that the colour like is all builded up, like the pink colour is so pigmented. What? Um, the colour is so pigmented. Like, really? Can you see that? Like, wow. But um, now like it's time to put um, my sample beauty eyeshadow palette to the test. Um, the purple shade in here is so pigmented. It's called Colossal. So it's this colour here, the purple one. Can you see that? I don't know if it's got, oh, oh. I don't know if it'll pick up on the camera. There we go. I would just be putting this colour on my crease because why not these flowers smell so beautiful like the color of them is unreal but anyway um like i just kind of pat this off a little bit like in the excess and i'll put this like on my crease i saw to build up the purple color so I'll, I'll, I'll just show you it's gonna keep building the color up because the purple shade will show through when like you cut the crease and pink and purple do look really pretty together as well can you see the color of that guys you building it up right now next up is using the p louise base in zero um honestly the p louise base is perfect honestly this is oh my god these flowers keep scaring me um this base is perfect for creating like a cut crease base on your eyelid because um 
the coverage is amazing. Um, what brush is this? It's like this little smudger brush, um, like it's a little small one, um, like it's perfect for cutting the crease out. I'll just put a little bit on, as you can see, and I will cut the crease of this. What I do is basically put it on my lid, like halfway down, kind of stroke it on, and then um, open my eyelid. I'll just kind of show you what I mean. This is really hard to explain. Open my eyelid normally, and there we go, creates a perfect little crease shape for your lid. So there we go, so now that um, this is pretty much done on my lid I will now um, use the blue shade from my sample beauty palette because I will show you how the colours all blend together because you guys need to seriously see this like super pretty. So now that this is all perfectly blended I will show you how to do that so make sure that this is closed and I'll get my little thing. The shade I will be using is Momentous, it's that blue one and the brush I will be using is this Spectrum brush in A12 honestly this brush is perfect for like the outer corner of your eye. And this blue shade guys is beautiful honestly blue colours make your eyes pop right. I actually have a mirror in this palette, it'll be easy to see. Oh my god, this blue shade is beautiful, can you see that guys? It's gonna keep um, putting this on my outer corner. So all I'd like now, like it's time to put the pigment primer on my eyelids. I will do that and then catch you up after this is all done, so yeah. So the pigment primer I, I will be using to kind of keep it, like my pigment in place. Here's this next pigment primer and I'll let you put a little bit on the back of my hand, like so. There we go, and I will use a smudger brush again to put it on with because it's easy to put it on the lid because it's like it's a perfect flat brush for this. So I will just put this where like the base is, so not over the blue really, to put it where the base is, and then let's keep putting it on. There we go. So now, oh, I've been going past. We love that. We love that. Um, but anyway guys, like I will be using this Peaches and Cream Pigment in Outer World, a lovely um, neon pink colour. So I'll open it and show you. It, it, like it will be hard to show on camera, but it's so pretty. I will be using a flat brush to apply this with. I'm going to I'm gonna have to put this like in a safe place because otherwise I'm going to spill it. And I can't get it on my carpet because my carpet is cream. So I'm just going to put this behind me and let's hope I don't like lean on it or something or spill it over. Put the lid on there because that's probably a good idea. Oh my god. Right, now, so I will pat this on my eyelid like so and build the neon pink colour. Um, honestly, this pink is so nice. Like the colour and everything. So vibrant. I love it. I'm going to keep building it up until it's all nice and perfect. This colour is going to look so pretty. Wow, can you see the colour pink, guys? The colour is beautiful. Oh my god. Wowie. Everybody, this is my finished makeup look. Honestly, this eye look is beautiful. Um, pink is my favourite colour. The eye pigment is like a neon pink. Um, the, the blue and the purple blend perfectly into the colours. Honestly, this is my favourite eye look that I love to create all the time. Honestly, it's so easy to create and honestly the colours that eyeshadow palette are so pigmented and this eye look is beautiful like you can wear this like a festival party literally wear this eye look to basically anything really and the colours and uh, like everything are beautiful also the eyelashes I used were the source of eyelashes in in Paris honestly these eyelashes are beautiful and um, really fluttery really nice and overall I would rate this eye look Ah, let's, let's have a look in the mirror. I really rate this look at uh, um, 9 out of 10 because the colours and everything are beautiful. The blend really well together. I also use my Rimmel foundation and um, the coverage of this foundation is amazing. Um, I used it in the shade Ivory and the colour is perfect. And the bronzer and the highlight, I use, I use the Urban Decay highlight and I use my Too Faced, and I use my Too Faced um, Natural Lust bronzer because honestly, the bronzer is gorgeous. Anyway guys, I'm going to end this makeup tutorial here. I literally had to have a blank moment then. Like, uh, my mind has gone so black today. But I really hope that you guys have enjoyed. And 
If you guys would like me to film another makeup tutorial, please leave a comment and a like. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye everybody!